everybody i'm gonna present you today how to make a 12 volt battery not as big as this one but a smaller one the parts necessary for this we're gonna use one more time these small power banks from pound shop they're just one pound we're gonna harvest the cell inside of them you're gonna find these kind of cells 18650 cells lithium ion is to harvest the cell to charge them individually and then discharge them with the IMAX B6 to see the actual amperage capacity we do have here after we already uh, discharged them so this is 1092 this one is 1100 this one it's 1000 so we're gonna search for another one yeah 1093 so this one is 1093 this is 1100 and this one is 1092 so this one all three are kind of matching the capacity after we have soldered to find out these uh, lithium ion cells we're gonna connect these batteries in series so we're gonna have ourselves a 12 volt battery for this one do not solder the, the stuff on it we're gonna need a 18650 holder like this one you can find it online or i'm gonna post some links below where i did bought this one it's pretty straightforward folks uh, how to make a 12 volt battery easy at home everybody can do it for lights for various projects that you're gonna need we're gonna solder some cables across here and there we're gonna enter the batteries and then we're gonna charge them we're gonna measure the stuff all right so let's get started so this is the case all this side is plus 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 this is minus 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 we're gonna flip it so here you got the connections as you can see we're gonna use just three slots we're gonna bridge a connection here and here we're gonna proceed by soldering this connection and then we're gonna extend some wires from this post which is gonna be positive and negative yeah so stay tuned we're gonna be back after soldering important thing when you're gonna make the extension the plus and minus you're gonna need a two piece of wire from the exact length and the same gauge like this one we're gonna cut it approximately this size we're gonna use this internet cable which is very thin because we're not gonna draw that many amps cut it in half so this stuff has to have the the same length of wire because of the resistance of the wires and so you're gonna see it later on we have managed to cut the wires and strip them and then you're gonna see here so i said that we're gonna start from here so this is gonna be the plus this is gonna be the plus connection of our battery so we're gonna connect this cable here after we're gonna solder them in place and one two three this one over here is gonna be the minus because I said already that we're not gonna use the all four slots but if you want you can use them all four of them and you're gonna make a 4s 1p battery which is gonna have like 16 volts when you're gonna charge it but for this project it's gonna be just 12 volts so I have plus and minus we're gonna solder the batteries and we're gonna be back after we did finish to solder this stuff we're gonna have like so we're gonna turn it so you're gonna have this one is the positive this one is the negative and all this is just straight connection we're gonna put some uh, tape on it here and there and we're gonna left with these two connections all right so stay tuned 
And so we have managed to solder to tape it and now I'm gonna put something distinctively to the plus wire to know which one is plus and which one is negative so this is gonna be our plus okay now let's see the proof so this one plus straight in this one with a minus again and this one with a plus okay okay no hitting let's bring in the multimeter and to see what's gonna happen there you go friends we have managed to bring in the multimeter as you can see this is the minus this is the plus here you go 12.13 so this battery needs a little bit charging we're gonna connect a 12 volt bulb and we're gonna see if it's gonna light or not there you go folks we have a 1.7 watts 12 volts bulb which is lighting perfectly this one draws like uh, 140 milliamps and as you can see it's very bright if we want to connect another thing we got an led strip which is this is plus so this is gonna be the plus come on friendly this should be minus here you go friends here you go so we have managed to build a 12 volts battery out of these three 18650 cells tell me what you think and tell me if you want to see next time how we're gonna do a 5 volts battery or a power bank for 4 amps maybe who knows we're gonna try it and make various combination of this stuff you know till next time that was all folks i show you how to make this uh, 18650 12 volt battery see you next time no, no skills required out friends thanks all for watching see you next time bye bye <laughs>